channel or if you're new here welcome my name is Eva and I'm the owner of Eva's essential kits I sell super cute self-defense items so if you're interested I will leave all the links down below in the description box stay pretty stay safe and shop with me so guys today I'm super excited because I'm finally gonna be introducing you guys to my small business I'm gonna be doing a little bit of business Q&A as well as showing off some of the items that we sell so before we get into the video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and become an essential queen guys look at the new merch these sweatshirts are available on our site for purchase under accessories i'm super excited they're mad cute they have like a hood they have a whole hood and then they're also a little bit like crop like a crop style and they have the crown they're just bomb stop playing they're so cute and then for like the summertime i'm definitely gonna um order like t-shirts or tank tops or the tube tops with the essential queens but yeah so definitely subscribe become an essential queen okay everything that i do all my hard work just who i am me i'm essential so period all right all right so after y'all subscribe don't forget to also turn on your post notifications so you get notified every single time i upload a video and also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up so without further ado let's get into it okay guys so in my small business i sell self-defense items as well as safety wholesale so we um sell the items in bulk so you can get wholesale if you want to start your own self-defense business or if you just want to buy a large quantity to maybe um you know get for a lot of people um and wholesale starts at um 10 items minimum and also uh, starts at a hundred dollars minimum but free shipping so we have free standard shipping on our whole site so everything is free standard shipping um but yeah we sell everything from stun guns to pepper spray brass knuckles um safety keychains we have discreet knives just a bunch of super cute stuff and before i get further into detail let it just be known that all of the items that we sell are for self-defense purposes only okay so this stuff is in case you know for when you're walking late at night maybe by yourself or you're in an uber or whatever just to you know help protect you in case you know help protect you from being mugged or you know god forbid kidnapped like all that type of stuff so just keep that in mind self-defense purposes only okay so i'm gonna get into our most popular um our most popular item which is hence the name of my business eva's essential kits here is actually one of our essential kits it's super cute let me get a, a little thumbnail okay move the hair that's a cute thumbnail that. okay so here it is this is actually one of our older logos i ordered some new logo stickers our new logo i think it's on the thank you card here. yeah our new logo has the crown all right right here and so the crown matches like on the shirt super cute but yeah so this is what an essential kit will look like it comes in this cute pink box it'll have our new logo and then when you open it y'all it'll look like this okay so inside is gonna come some super cute women empowerment stickers all right so this is actually someone's order this one says girl power this one says empowered women empower women love that We're also gonna get our thank you card now our thank you cards have a discount code on them guys okay don't throw them away save it because if you want to come back which i know you probably will because everything's super cute you want to use that discount code for 10 percent off and it's going to be right on this card so just keep that in mind and then this is what comes in our essential kit so the first thing is a stun gun okay and the stun gun always comes with a free velcro black case you're also going to get one of our discreet knives. The most popular one is our knife comb. All right, you open it up and bam, look at that. And this fully functions as a comb, so you can comb your, your, um, your hair with this. And then you're also gonna get your keychain pepper spray, okay? So the pepper spray is in here. You just open it up and there's your pepper spray. And then along with those things you're gonna get some other little goodies you're gonna get a cute silky scrunchie you're gonna get some lashes and then you're also gonna get some lip gloss or lip oil so you get all that in the essential kit and it's if you want all three of these items get the essential kit because it's cheaper to get the essential kit than it is to buy the items individually um so just purchase the essential kit and yeah, they're our best sellers. They come in purple, pink, and black. So when you get the essential kits, 
all of the self-defense items are always going to be the same color so you know if you get the purple one all the items are purple if you get the black one you know the stun gun the pepper spray and the knife comb are black so um it'll be like that so yeah that is our essential kit super cute okay so moving on i want to show you guys our next most popular items which well item and it's our pink stun gun this is like the most the next most popular thing everybody be wanting to cop this and then go fast so cop up but our stun guns okay and it's super cute and they also come in our other popular colors are like black and purple you guys just saw the purple one let me get the black one for y'all this is the black one okay so you got your pink purple and black all right so all of these all right so these are our most popular ones they also come in other colors guys we have yellow we have blue we have teal we have a dark purple sometimes we even have printed ones so we have zebra stripes um stun guns we have camel ones like red green for the holidays so yeah i'm gonna just show you how these work so with your stun gun these are rechargeable and they're also flashlights so at the bottom here there's this circular plastic button you're going to press it down and slide and then the prongs will come out and you can plug this right into the wall this little red light should light up when it's plugged in to let you know it's really charging on the side here there's this switch when you switch it up one way i mean once the um flashlight will come on it's super bright and then when you switch it up a second time, the red light will come on, which lets you know that your stun gun is activated. You'll press the little circle button here. And y'all ready? Uh, this one has to be charged a little bit. Let me show y'all the, the, um, the purple one. Listen to this. Okay. Okay. So, like, who gonna run up? Who gonna run up? Run up, get done up. stun guns the next things that are the most popular are the knife combs okay so y'all saw the purple one they come in other colors we have pink black blue we also have teal and orange as well so like i said they're a fully functioning comb but then you'd be like what's up pop off right and we're talking about to attackers y'all okay we're talking about to like you know muggers and rapists and all that stuff like that like what's what's popping are you not about to do me you know all right so then we have these and then our pepper sprays so my favorite pepper spray that we sell is our rhinestone jumbo keychain pepper sprays like look how pretty this is it's so bomb so i love these because they're the most convenient so this top part where you see it's like clear is actually glow in the dark so you can actually see where you're aiming in the dark which is important this one also contains uv dye so if you were to spray your attacker and then hold a black light up to them um their face would glow so it can help authorities identify your attacker and it's just super cute it's just super convenient you don't got to take the pepper spray out of an actual case this is just the actual pepper spray. Um, the hard shells are like that too. We have the hard shell pepper sprays, but they are only for wholesale. So let me show y'all. These ones are only for wholesale. Um, just because the girls like to make keychains out of these and stuff. But they're pretty much the same thing, but they're just like plain. And I actually have this pink one on my personal self-defense keychain. So yeah, so these are available for wholesale. A bunch of different colors, red, blue, um... We got black purple pink and then they also come in like yellow orange teal so yeah wholesale colors always come mixed but you can leave us a note at checkout to let us know what colors you prefer most of and we'll do our best to accommodate um we also have our bling soft pepper spray keychains this one is the purple one here's the black one look at that y'all super pretty okay and then the pepper sprays are inside and then like you saw in the essential kit, they all come with the plain soft case. So here's the black one and y'all saw the, the, um, the purple one in her kit, but yeah. And then when you open it, here's this pepper spray, all right? So those are, those are our pepper sprays. Um, we also have a few other discreet um, knives. Here's one of them. These are our lipstick blades. So when you open it, 
it literally looks like a lipstick but then when you twist it no lipstick look at that like it's a blade stop playing okay we also have pen knives so pen knives um they really write but they are blades like they're knives as well you can check out all the different um discrete self-defense items we have like i said the link is down below at evasekits.com and then we also sell other things um strictly for wholesale so this is my personal self-defense keychain because by the way guys we do sell self-defense keychains and they'll come with like a wristlet like this um we have a couple different prints however they'll only come with the coubaton and the alarm and like the little puff and then it has like a chapstick and a lipstick um i mean a chapstick and a hand sanitizer holder um but this is my own personal one so this is the one that i actually carry around with me and it has a chanel wristlet like how cute is that and i'm actually going to be dropping a designer keychain a designer self-defense keychain line it's coming soon so you want to make sure you're following us on instagram at eva essentials underscore um okay so you can um stay up to date with when they're gonna drop we're gonna have chanel print louis vuitton print all like designer keychain inspired um gucci so yeah you definitely want to set some notifications for that so on mine these coubatons we sell these for wholesale so you'll get them mixed colors they come in all different colors um blue green red silver black all that okay and these are meant to help you easily escape like a sinking car or a burning building they break glass extremely easily all you have to do is one jab and the window or whatever will shatter and they're also meant to be used as a self-defense stick so um you know a striking there's certain certain striking points on an attacker um we have some of like um we have some of those like some tips on how to use a coubaton up on our instagram page but yeah so coubatons and then we also sell alarm keychains for wholesale so they look like this all right and these will come on our other safety keychains but the alarm keychains they come a bunch of come in a bunch of different colors they have a flashlight so you press the little button here and it's a flashlight and then this black wristlet when you pull it an alarm goes off so i'm about to do it stop playing ready <laughs> so loud but it can be heard up to 60 feet away which is crazy so that will come on the keychain and these are also available for wholesale we have a bunch of different colors white gold you know, teal and yeah all right and then uh something else we um have for wholesale are our kitty knuckles and our brass knuckles we sell brass knuckles the classic brass knuckles in pink blue purple like basically just everything cute we just bought cute and pretty to self-defense okay and then the kitty um keychain knuckles um i know the girls like to put like all of these items with the pepper spray and everything like on their keychains when they make them um so we sell these too as well these are just basically a different version of brass knuckles and they come in also all different colors so we have these um, we have a bunch of other stuff too guys we have some accessories like i said the sweatshirt will be on the site we also sell um spiker prevention drink covers so when you're out with your girlfriends it covers up your drink but it has a hole for your straw so that way no one can put anything into your drink and you're secured all night and yeah guys those are some of our most popular items and some of the things that we sell here at, uh, here at Eva's Essential Kits. I'm also going to get into some Q&A right now that y'all have for me. Let me just grab my notebook because I had it. So hold on one second. All right. So on our Instagram, we put a question box and y'all ask some questions. So I'm going to answer a few of them. Um, these are strictly about the business. So the first question is... Um, what inspired you to start a self-defense business slash what motivates you so what inspired me to start a self-defense business well i am a young mother and i'm obviously a woman so being out by myself you know to run my errands or having to run my errands with my kids alone it kind of it gave me a lot of anxiety and so definitely having like my safety keychain 
it just makes me feel 10 times more secure and i just think about how like i have a daughter i want her to be protected you know she's only one right now but when she gets bigger i'm just high on self-defense like my mom my sister all the craziness that's been happening like in the world and it just keeps getting worse you just gotta stay protected so i love to make women have less anxiety about going out and feel safe you know when they're running their errands or with their kids or you may be going to work late at night or they have to take public transportation like you just feel 10 times more secure having something like this on you or having a stun gun on you having a pepper spray on you you just feel safer so i love that and these items are all super convenient they can go right into your pocketbook um, some of them are super discreet. You can't even tell that they're like self-defense items like the lipstick and the knife comb. So yeah, what really inspired me was just personally being a young woman and a young mother um, and having a lot of anxiety when going out. So now that, you know, now that I have these items, it has definitely reduced that. So yeah. So um, what motivates me? What motivates me to continue my small business is number one, I don't work for nobody else. Okay, I work for myself. If I have to work for anybody in this lifetime and make anybody rich, it's gonna be me at this point, okay? So I don't have to ask no, you know, boss for permission to take time off or have nobody over my head telling me what to do. I'm my own boss. So that's number one that motivates me. Um, well, alongside, of course, I can't say number one, but that's definitely the top one. But the number one, let me just say that first, is my family, my kids, okay? They motivate me because I know I want my business to just do really well and be really successful, and I want to give them the best. So my kids and my family motivate me. I know that I want this to eventually become my family's main source of income. So they motivate me. I want to give them everything. I want to, you know, everything and more. So they motivate me that's that's number one um but then yeah then after that i'm my own boss so love that um what else motivates me i just have my notes here so i'm looking but um what else motivates me is um time okay i used to be um i, I used to only have obviously the two uh, my two sons and i used to have to get up in the morning get myself ready get them ready feed them breakfast pack their bags drive um drop them to school and then i hit you know school traffic gotta get to my job then it's just it was like a hot mess and now i just had another baby you know so time management is so important and when you have kids it just it makes it 10 times harder to be on time so the fact that i am on my own timing i have my own schedule i make my own hours is everything i don't have to worry about because you know kids are kids and it's like in the morning you could be on time for work and then all of a sudden your kid gets a fever now you gotta call out or your kids spill something all over your work clothes now you gotta change now you're late and then you hit the buses you know the traffic and everything and it's just like life happens and so it sucks to have to be, you know, you in jeopardy of losing your job or whatever it may be, cut, you know, cut pay because of your children or just like, you know, just life. So the fact that I make my own hours and my own schedule and I don't got to worry about running here and there and getting them ready, getting me ready. I work from home. It's just, it's so nice. So that's another thing that motivates me. Um, also, coworkers. Okay. I don't got to work with no nasty co-workers, all right, because I've had my fair share of them, and it's just ridiculous. At this age, you would think that people would know how to act right in a professional setting, and they just don't, and it's like, I'm not the boss at my other job, so I can't just not, you know, I can't fire this person. I got to work with them. I got to deal with them. I don't want to come to work every morning, and I don't like Karen, and Karen all in my face, and it's just like... And like, I just got to suck it up. I just don't want to be at a job that I don't love. So it's like, I don't, and I don't want to deal with nobody that I don't want to deal with. It's like, I don't want to deal with you and your attitude. Cause you may come into work and you're in a good mood, but maybe like, you know, Carol, she got into a fight with her husband last night and now she's nasty to me for no reason. I don't need that Carol. Okay. I didn't have a fight with my boyfriend. So, you know, keep that over there. And it's just like, mm don't want to do it don't want to deal with people i don't like all right i don't want to ask for pay time off or ask permission to do nothing or have someone standing over my head um time management like i said like i don't want to have to be upset because you know my kid got a fever and now i can't come into work and now i lose pay or now like i'm late and now i'm in trouble like i don't i don't want to deal with all that so those things keep me motivated. The fact that I don't have to deal with none of that keeps me motivated. All right, so question number two, 
was is it expensive to start a business so it doesn't have to be when i first started my business i wasn't working a nine to five that i could use the money for my nine to five to invest into my business um, I actually had to, I actually had people invest into me. So like my boyfriend invested into me financially and so did my mom. And then I paid like, I paid them back after I made my profit. Well, not my boyfriend, but I paid my mom back. And um, so yeah, so it doesn't have to be. I think I spent like $300 to first start my business. And that included getting my logo done, um, packaging. I got my first packaging on like Amazon and then my inventory. My inventory is a little pricey just because of what I sell. Um, so yeah, and the thing is like if you're someone who has the money to invest into your small business before you launch and you can afford to like save up and then, you know, get like custom boxes and like the whole nine and get a whole like large set of inventory, then go for it. That That's good. That's you. But if you don't like I did it, it's okay. You could start and as long as you have like the basics you're good to go and then when you make your profit just remember to invest back into your business and upgrade so like when i made my profit i upgraded to pink cute boxes i got like you know my nice custom logo stickers i didn't have that when i first started i had like the plain white boxes just the packaging wasn't all that like you know what i mean but eventually i invested into it so it doesn't have to be expensive you could start small and then you know reinvest and then you know upgrade also you're gonna sit on inventory when you first start if you start with a lot you know what i mean so i suggest starting like we um we offer like a minimum of 10 items for our wholesale that's a good place to start 10 of each item um start with that because if you go and buy a hundred of each item especially when you're first starting you're gonna sit on it so it's just like it doesn't it, it doesn't make sense don't do that so yeah start small um so yeah it doesn't have to be expensive it's all you know what i mean you're gonna have to have some funds but i've even seen videos like how to start a lip gloss business with a hundred dollars like look for it do some research look on youtube make sure you're looking for um you know vendors with the lowest price don't just jump on the first thing that you see or the first person to make an offer or the first person who says they do logos like do your research so it doesn't have it doesn't have to be expensive but you know you know you have to spend money to make money so just keep that in mind okay number three it says what inspired you to start a youtube so what inspired me to start my youtube was just to grow my business i just wanted uh, another like audience platform so we're already on um instagram and we're on tiktok and i just i also love to inspire and talk like i'm doing now and whatnot and so i thought youtube would be the perfect platform for me because i'm in front of the camera and a lot of people are interested in how i run my business you know the behind the scenes and all of that so i was like this is perfect and i see a bunch of other you know young girls doing it so why can't i and here i am so yeah that's what really inspired me to start my youtube i just want to grow my business grow my audience and i love to inspire so yeah okay number four says what does my business sell so i kind of just showed y'all um, you know, we sell the stun guns, we sell keychain alarms, pepper spray, brass knuckles, all self-defense items, and they're all super cute. Um, number five says, what are your future business goals? So my future business goals, um, one of them I mentioned before, is for my business to be my family's main source of income. I want my business to grow and be so big that I can not only afford to like financially take care of my personal family like you know me and my man my kids but like I can start giving money to my boyfriend's mom I can give money to my parents like I can start taking care of other people in other ways I want to I just want to be successful in this business I don't want to have to go back to a nine to five that's my business goal to be so big I don't go I don't got to go back to a nine to five job so that is definitely one of my business goals um i want to be the queen of safety wholesale let me say that too okay i've already claimed the title i don't know but like you know i haven't really seen other girls doing wholesale for self-defense items i've seen a, a, a few other self-defense um wholesale businesses but none super cute like mine okay not cute packaging and pink boxes and and all that for the safety stuff when even for my vendor i get it in like you know a plain beat up cardboard box and it's just not cute there's no cute stickers there's no there's no face behind the brand i have a cute face behind the brand like you know like i want to be the queen of safety wholesale i want my wholesale to take off 
you know i love selling my individual items but my wholesale is my main thing where we offer free shipping for our wholesale so our prices remember inflation right now is crazy but we also also uh, we also offer free shipping which none of my other competitors do okay so keep that in mind um, number six is what content will you be dropping here on youtube so um as far as content i'm going to be dropping vlogs so this is um business personal i mean business lifestyle and um vlogs so i'll probably doing some like you know i guess like days of my life and stuff like that like a day in my life of an entrepreneur you'll definitely see some uh business related stuff you know uh, package orders with me or you know how to start a business i'll probably do you know videos on different topics business related i'm definitely going to be doing a video soon on um my mentorship kit program because i have a program in my business where um, I will do sessions with you to help you grow or start your small business. So I'm going to be doing a whole video on that, talking about that. Um, but it is something my business offers. So if you are interested in starting your own small business or you have a business already and you want to grow it, it doesn't have to be a self-defense business, but y'all can talk with me and I can help y'all out. So yeah, so that's the kind of um, content I'll be having here, business and lifestyle. Number seven, is it hard being a mom and an entrepreneur? That's a winning question because it is, and I'm actually gonna make a whole video on how I balance entrepreneurship and motherhood because so far all of my mentees and my mentorship program have been mothers. And a lot of my other small business ladies are mothers. And if you're scared to start a small business because you're also a mom, you don't think you could do it, I'm gonna tell you how you can do it because I'm doing it and others have done it and you could be successful. So it is it is challenging, but the number one thing I can say is have a routine. A routine is key. That's it's less stress. You you know what happens at what time, what you can when you can do this, when you can do that. I know when my kids are at school and my daughter's napping, that's the time for me to get content. That's the time for me to, you know, make a TikTok or whatever. I have certain days where, you know, my man is home and it's my um it's my filming days or whatever. Like I just have a routine and I have a set schedule for things and that just helps me out so much. So that's the biggest thing I can say. Of course, it's challenging. It's hard just, you know, being a mom and then it's hard just, you know, being a, a, a work hardworking woman and working a job and you so combining the both. Yeah, it's hard, but, you know, it's not impossible and you can be successful. And if you want to know how join my mentorship kit program okay is a feature on my website i'm gonna leave the link down below but yeah it's it has its challenges everything has its challenges but it can be done okay guys so those are all of the questions thank you guys for asking them just wanted to introduce you to eva's essential kits and let y'all know about us so yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope all this information was helpful don't forget to shout with me okay stay pretty stay safe don't forget to also hit that subscribe button and become an essential queen and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys